Hello and welcome to my new YouTube channel. Oh, you saw my knife there. Woo. Um, this is I Unbox, where, as you may have guessed it, I unbox things for you. Pretty much the whole premise of the, the channel. Um, yeah, a bit of backstory. I've been unboxing things since I was very young. Um, I believe my first may have been Christmas or possibly um, my birthday was the first time I unboxed things. Um, I can't remember what year exactly. It was a very long time ago, but I thought... I will share my expertise of unboxing things for you guys on camera. And what a better way to start off the channel than something really, really exciting, which is the Ketter Drawcart 4D. Not 2D, not 3D, but 4D. In your face, you can smell the box. Um, or it just means there's four drawers in this set. So yeah, so the whole point in this channel is anything I get through the post, I'm going to box it for you. If it comes in a box, um, then I'm going to open it up give it a look at it, give it my kind of opinion of the item and uh, just share it with you. Try not to make these videos too long, uh, just want to have a bit of fun with you guys and show you some products. So as I said before, this is uh, uh, effectively a stack of drawers. Um, I'm upgrading my gaming room within the property and I've decided I need to be a bit more organised, be a bit more grown up instead of having stuff just lying around. And I saw these on Argos, that's where I picked this item from. Um, yeah, apparently it's easy assembly. Don't even see that there or not. Yeah, easy assembly. Um, and if you're from other countries like France, Spain, or is that Germany? Deutschland? Yes. Einfach Montag. Don't know if I just told butchered that or not. But yeah, if you're from those countries, um, it means easy assembly as well. And uh, it's got assembled dimensions other languages. Dimensions of this box are length, width, height, 12.5 inches by 15.2 inches by 32.7 inches. Or a few people will do centimetres, 33 centimetres by 38.5 by 83. So that's kind of your height, 83 centimetres. Um, and it is made in the UK. One of the very few products which are still made in the UK and not from other countries out with the UK, which with Brexit, we could maybe see a lot more of this because nobody wants to trade with us. Anywho, I'm now two and a half minutes into the video and I'm not even started unboxing the box, which is the whole point of the channel. So excuse the settings at the moment. I'm preparing the studio. This is just too big a box for me to actually open the studio at the moment. So it's in the living room with a kitchen knife. Um, if anyone wants to send me a knife, send me a PM. Um, I will gladly showcase your knife for the unboxings, but for now, it's going to have to be a serrated kitchen knife, which this technically isn't classed an unboxing because it's out of a box already. But let's stop blabbering and let's cut the tape. Try and get this as best on camera, see it is quite a large item. Oh, look, there's your storage number if you want Argos, it's 914-3786. Order it from Argos if you are interested in this item. I'm no way is sponsored by Argos. This is just where I picked this up. Um, I don't know if they sell them anywhere else or it's exclusive to that store. But you're obviously, if you found this video, probably looking to buy a set of drawer carts. Um, so yeah. When we open the box, first thing we see inside is a red bottom. So this is actually a red set. They come in different colours. Black, grey, white. And um, because my game room's kind of red, Decide on this. So what I'll do, pop the box down inside here. Nothing really much exciting about the actual box itself. These are the items you get inside the box, and which I will be assembling. Um, quite neatly packed actually. So everything's kind of been put inside the drawers. Look how exciting this! Hey, lots of bits of plastic coming out of a box. Lots of it. It's like Lego for adults but not as fun as Lego, and not bricks. Ah, there's your drawers. And what looks to be a bit tight. There's the rest of the item. So yeah, pretty much. This is everything flat packed, and there's your casters, cause it is a cart, so you can't move these around. Um, I've actually got the gray version. Why am I out of breath on doing that? I was only taking stuff out of a box. Um, yeah, you can cart this around, good if you've got maybe a laminate flooring or something, uh, move it around the kitchen or whichever room you require the drawers to be in. 
So I'm going to come back in a sec with this fully assembled. Um, hopefully it won't be too long. For you, it'll be a couple of seconds. For me, it could probably be five hours. Uh, we'll see how good the easy assemble is. Before I start assembling, I just thought I'd give you a better layout of how everything comes in the box. So as you see, here's all your legs, different layers of the shelves. Um, there's your drawers, casters, and the roof of the drawers. So say, be a bit of a second, just I'll be back, be very quick, and get this all finished built for you. Thank you all. So I have to say, that was a pretty easy build. Um, in all seriousness, barely takes five minutes to click these things together. Um, and it is a pretty solid click. Uh, start from the bottom, you've got your base plate, put your four legs, put the next base plate on, four legs, base plate, four legs, till you eventually get to the top, and just pop your drawers in. Um, good thing as well, all the drawers are the same size, so it doesn't matter which way they kind of put them in. They'll stack up as they should do. But yeah, I'm quite happy with this little set of drawers. Um, so for the purpose I've got, just going to be putting some things from the game room, like controllers and... Uh, maybe some games into the, the drawers themselves, so perfect for what I'm using it for. Um, it came at about £14.99, I kind of missed out on a little bit of a reduction in the price, but for £15, if you need a quick, easy storage, say for the kitchen, for the garage, uh, I would recommend picking these up. I'm uh, just going to get a little bit closer, I had to put the camera right back so you can see the size of these things. Now, I have got them in the casters, you can just see them just down here, so they are in the casters. But yeah, I'll get the camera a little bit closer and we'll see what everything looks like. A bit closer up. Closer, closer, closer. So here's a closer look at the drawers for you. I just thought I'd bring in. We've got a little logo at the top here. Um, just plastic, kind of see-through drawers. You can see the, the red of the frame down there. So they're great drawers for the price point. Uh, £15 to pay for these from Argos. I, see, I don't know if they're available anywhere else. Um, got the casters, so you can. Not the best, I've got quite a thick carpet. You can kind of spin it round. That's just the back. They don't actually, do they come at the back? No, they actually have a kind of stopping point. Yeah. So you really can't get it wrong. Plus it actually says uh, front, I think, somewhere. Eh. No, they've actually taken all that. It's must be underneath the door, is it? Yeah, front. Can you see that? It's in red. Yeah. That's just the front of the door. So yeah, not going to over gloss much else. It's a set of drawers, four drawers. Use them for whatever you like. Um, I'll be using it for all odds and sods. See, I've already got about four sets of these already. Really handy for the price point. Um, if you plastic itself, it's not going to flex too much, but I wouldn't put too many heavy things in it. Um, if it does lean forward, the drawers will kind of slide out, but obviously with more heavier items in there, I probably won't. Uh, but overall, five for money is what I'll say. Uh, but hopefully you enjoyed the channel, guys. See this first video. I kind of had to do it in the living room because the box was that big and the videos will come from different locations depending on the size of the box. Um, going forward, as I said, anything that comes to me in a box, I'll open it for you. Um, going forward, hopefully, if you find the channel, I'll put a PO box out there so you can send me items, um, mystery boxes effectively, and I'll unbox them on camera for you. But until that gets going, the first video, I don't want to get jumping ahead of myself. Um, let's just stick to opening stuff like this and um, when I receive stuff I'll bring it to you guys to look at it. That's all for now guys see you for the next video do remember to like the video if you enjoyed it and leave a little comment about what you've unboxed recently tell me what you're unboxing. Bye for now.